It's just Audette here by herself. Where's Grace at? Well, well, look who's here. <laughs> Hi, Tuku told me all about you and our little Evie in the tent. He did? Mm-hmm. I'm so happy for you guys. Huh, thanks. And I hear she's quite the lucky girl. Uh, lucky? What do you mean? Oh, come on, you know what I mean. Wink. No need to be shy, big fella. <laughs> ha ha. You looking for her? Y yeah. I think she's helping Grace with her bike. In the garage. All right, thanks. You're welcome, stud. Mmm, lucky girl indeed. <laughs> I feel like Aunt Ed is scheming something. I can't believe she's giving you this much trouble. Well, it is an old secondhand part. You should have sprung for a new one. <laughs> like we can afford that. Y yeah, I know. Come on, baby, work for mama. Damn it. Uh, I need to take a break. Not having any luck? <gasps> Aura. Hey there, Aura. Hi, Grace. You know, you've got something on your face. <laughs> yeah, very funny. I don't understand why it isn't working. Everything looks fine. Did you try rebooting it? Haha, <laughs> shut up. You two have the same silly sense of humor, you know that? Mm-hmm. Why do you think I like him so much? <laughs> I'm gonna go wash up and check on Audette. God knows what she's doing in the shop by herself. Can you two behave yourselves if I leave you alone in here? No. Why don't you run upstairs and grab us some beer, Aura? I'll call the hookers. <laughs> <laughs> Eve, <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> I don't think Aura thought you were joking. I knew you were joking the moment I saw them. Brat, I'll be right back. It sucks she can't get her bike working. Yeah, I know. I wish I could do something to cheer her up. Hmm, I could try and take a look at it. You mean Grace's bike? Yeah. What do you know about bikes, Aura? Oh, absolutely nothing. <laughs> but I used to help my dad out when he fixed the lawnmowers all the time. How different could it be? Uh, I don't know. It wouldn't hurt to take a look, right? I guess not. Hmm. You see anything? I don't know. I... Okay. Uh, yeah, look here. Hmm? These wires are a bit frayed. And here, these bolts are a bit loose. Would that really stop the bike from starting? It's possible. Can you fix it? I think so. Just give me one second. Can you hand me that wrench? Y yeah, sure. Thanks. Uh... Okay, you want to try and start her? M me? Hell yeah. Well, go ahead. <laughs> All right, that'll be $200. <laughs> Huh? Eve started as the engine hummed to life. The surprise on her face was priceless, though to be honest, I was just as surprised. I really hadn't expected my tiny repairs would fix the problem. You're amazing. What the hell? You got it started? Aura did it. Huh, I just tapped a couple wires and tightened a few bolts. You did all the hard stuff. Oh my god, thank you. Your boyfriend is full of surprises, Evie. I know, right? You think we could take it for a spin? What? Oh, come on, we're old enough. You don't even have a license. Aura has one. Hmm. We'll be careful. I don't know. Oh, let them take it around the block a few times, Grace. He did fix it for you, after all. Huh, you're right. Yes. But just around the block, okay? Come on, Aura. Huh? Put helmets on. <laughs> it felt good to be the hero and earn some major brownie points with even her sister. Plus, we got to take Grace's bike out for a ride, which was awesome. We had an absolute blast, and Eve looked adorable in that helmet. I don't think I had ever seen her so happy. You're pretty good on that thing. Thanks. That was awesome. <laughs> wow, we were really flying. Did you see us, Grace? <laughs> yeah, I saw you. You're so cute. Shut up. <laughs> We should probably get back to the shop. Pfft, screw that. Your bike is finally fixed and it's getting late anyways. Let's go upstairs and celebrate. Yeah. What if a customer comes in? Grace, seriously. You can take one night off. Huh? Come on, sis. You really need a break. Huh? All right, fine. Thank God. Grab us some drinks and get the fire started. I'll close up. You're sure? Yes, go. I'll be right there. You want to help me? Totally. Come on, Aura. Oh, okay. So the fucking idiot decides he's gonna climb up on our roof and cannonball into our pool. Holy crap, really? <laughs> yeah, only he's so drunk he gets about halfway up the <laughs> lattice? What the fuck is a lattice? Is that a ladder? What is a lat? Oh, it's a type of, f it's a fence? Oh, I know what a lattice is. I just didn't know the name, <laughs> okay. 
and falls off into our mom's thorn bushes. No way. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah, Tuku always does some stupid shit when he's drinking. He's not the only one. Remember Odette in the table? Oh god, I forgot about that. <laughs> oh, tell me. She was trying to impress some guy she really liked, and this funny hip-hop song came on the radio. What was it called? Baby Got Stacked? All right. <laughs> That's it. It's basically a song about a girl with giant tits. Huh, okay. So this song comes on and Audette, who had been drinking rum and cokes all night, decides she's gonna get up on the table and dance. For real? <laughs> yeah. And we're talking real slutty dancing too, you know, because she's trying to seduce this guy. Mm-hmm. She's got her bikini top on and her tits are bouncing all over the place, so of course every guy at the party is mesmerized. Huh, she has such an unfair advantage. I know, right? I would kill for tits like that. Oh, please. It could be a lot worse, you know. I mean, look at these pathetic things. Nah, yours are cute. They're like super perky. Guys love that. Yeah, right. Pretty sure Aura is the only guy who likes them. Oh, really? So you like my sister's tits, <laughs> Aura? Uh, yeah, of course I do. I think they're perfect. P perfect? Aw. But, but yours are nice, too. Okay, you definitely found a keeper with this one. <laughs> <laughs> I think so too. So what happened next? Hmm? With Audette in the table. Oh right. Well, she's up on the table dancing and everyone starts chanting, take it off over and over. D did she do it? Of course she did it. It's Audette. <laughs> Except right as she started to untie her top, the table broke. You're joking. <laughs> nope. It snapped right down the middle and she went flying. Broke her arm in two places. Dang. It's true. I had to drive her to the hospital. That's nothing compared to the night you had to get your stomach pumped. Uh, don't make me relive that one, please. <laughs> I'm telling you, my sister used to be the queen of throwing parties. That was a long time ago. Now she just works all the time. Psst. Well, somebody has to act like an adult around here. God knows Audette and Tuku never will. Yeah, yeah. Just not tonight, okay? I'm really not that person anymore, Eve. Come on, Grace. I want to hang out with my fun, crazy older sister again. Uh, I'll try, okay? I don't know why it's so hard for you two. Eve, please don't start. Why don't you go and get the fire started? I've never done that before, but okay. Didn't dad enroll you in Girl Scouts when you were younger? He tried, but I refused to go, remember? Hmm. Oh yeah, I can't believe you got away with that. Man, you really were his favorite. He had me going to those meetings for six years. Well, I wasn't his favorite for very long. That's true, I guess. You want some help carrying that? No, it's okay. Are you sure? It has to be heavy. Really, it's fine, Grace. I mean, I got level 10 strength. I should be able to carry that, no problem. I've got it. You you do realize I have no idea what I'm doing over here? You should probably go and help her. Snap. Ouch, mother Damn it, I broke a nail. <laughs> I think you're right about that. Just put the beer over there by the tent. Sure thing. Let me do it. Man, this thing is heavier than it looks. How many beers did they cram into it, I wonder? Go and get the music started. Now you're talking my language. <sighs> uh, alright. Here you go. Thanks, Sora. Sorry, I couldn't find any warm, skunky ones past their expiration date. You know, since that's the way you usually drink them? Oh, haha, <laughs> very funny. Haha, <laughs> you got any music preference? Nah, anything is fine. Okay, this is- this hot take. Hot take. I don't- I love music, right? But I don't have a favorite genre. I just have favorite songs. I don't think, like, I prefer any genre over the other. There might be genres where I have more songs I like, but I don't really see it as me liking that genre specifically. It's just I found more music I like in that genre. But I can listen to pretty much anything and probably find something I like. I actually went to, like, a classical concert for a class, because I had to do a review of, like, a classical concert. And it, I actually had a very fun time. I really enjoyed the music there. And then I also enjoy, uh, like, I grew up with, like, rock and hip-hop and stuff like that. So, like, it, I'm pretty much a jack-of-all-trades when it comes to music. I can listen to I, certain types of country are pretty good. None of that, like, slow, like, bye-bye. I don't fucking... <laughs> but the more, like, dancey kind of country songs, hell yeah. I think I'll start us off with some classic rock. That's Grace's favorite. Works for me. Uh, I really hope Grace cuts it loose tonight. You wouldn't believe how much fun she used to be. I think she's pretty fun now, Eve. Yeah, yeah, but nothing like before the accident. You really think that accident is to blame? I hope so. Otherwise, it's my fault. How could it be your fault? 
You, you know, because she's stuck taking care of me. Isn't it possible she just grew out of the whole party scene? I mean, people do that. They get older and their priorities change. Yeah, I guess. Don't worry about it so much. Let's just focus on having fun tonight, huh? You're right. You always make me feel better, Aura. Thank you. Here you go. Thanks. No problem. Hmm. You sure got that fire started quickly. Yeah, I guess those six years in Girl Scouts really paid off, huh? Huh, seems like it. Huh, hey, by the way, you did a great job the other night. Hmm? You know, when my sister opened up to you about her, you know, the scar? Well, that and all the emotional baggage. She was a wreck for a long time after our parents died. <laughs> Actually, we both were. I understand, believe me. Oh, that's right. Eve told me you just lost your dad. Y yeah, I'm really sorry, Aura. Here, I am complaining about our problems from years ago and your wounds are fresh. No, really, it's fine. I'm getting through it. Honestly, I think talking about it and trading painful experiences with others really helps heal, you know? Hmm. You're a really great guy, Aura. <laughs> It's just the meme where I'm putting a medal over myself. This is so... I'm glad Eve found you. So am I. Man, I wish someone felt that way about me. Are you sure somebody doesn't? Hmm? Nothing. Never mind. Cheers? Cheers. Clink. All right, bitches. Who's ready to partay? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Woo. Just don't go too crazy, please. Uh-oh, sounds like somebody needs a shot of fireball. Absolutely not. Aw, oh, come on, Grace. Yeah, come on, Grace. Don't be a potty pooper. Huh, fine, give it here. That's my girl. Drink your medicine. Ugh, God. <coughs> Been a while since I've had any of that. Good shit, huh? Can I try some? No, I think you better stick to beer. Of course you can have some. Audette. What? We were younger than her when we started drinking this stuff. And it's just us here. What's the worst that can happen? <coughs> uh, holy shit. This stuff really burns. Mm-hmm. That's how you know it's working. You want some, stud? Oh, he wants some. Uh, sh sure, I guess. Coming right up fine, sir. Haha. <laughs> <coughs> you alright, Aura? Uh, good lord. What is that? Cinnamon whiskey. It's awful. <laughs> Did you get everything locked up downstairs? Would you stop worrying and have some fun? I just wanted to make sure. Yes, everything is locked up. Relax. Why don't we play a game or something? A game? Yes, yes, yes. Truth or dare? No, not truth or dare. That's kitty shit. Ugh, I don't know many drinking games. Never have I ever? Bingo. Huh? <laughs> it's a drinking game. How does it work? It's really easy. All you have to do is admit to something that you've done before. For instance, ahem, never have I ever masturbated with a hairbrush. What? All right, well, people do that, I guess. <laughs> What? Now anyone here ha now anyone here that has masturbated with a hairbrush drinks a shot. You're a bitch, you know that? Haha. <laughs> you just love bringing this shit up. So wait a second. That means huh yes, I masturbated with a hairbrush a couple of times back when I lived at home with mom and dad. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Why? Uh, because I was horny and didn't have anything else. Why didn't you just buy yourself a dildo? Uh, you did meet our parents, right? Yes. Dad wouldn't let us work, so I had no money to buy one. And if that wasn't enough, mom was always snooping around in our rooms. Oh my good, could you imagine if she had found a dildo in your room? She would have shit a brick. Totally. Still though, a hairbrush. Just the handle. <laughs> <laughs> All right then, bitch, my turn. Never have I ever had a three-way on a pool table in front of a room full of people. Huh? Wow, that is really specific. You, you really did that? Once, and it was a long time ago. Ew. You only live once, Evie. That's when people started calling you the Chinese finger trap, you know? <laughs> Ugh, don't bring that up. <laughs> I don't get it. Me neither. Think about it. Huh? Uh, uh, never mind. All right, can we ask questions that aren't specifically targeting each other now? Hey, you started it. Yeah, yeah. Why don't you go, Aura? M me? Do you understand the rules? I think so. Hmm, let's see. Never have I ever shoplifted. You've never stolen anything in your entire life? Nope. Ugh, I think you're supposed to ask naughty questions, Aura. No, that question was perfect. Hmm? It got us all drinking, didn't it? Well, yeah. That's the entire purpose of the game, Evie. Nice job, Aura. Thanks. Your turn, sis. Okay, I've got one that will get all three of you for sure. All right, let's hear it. Never have I ever kissed a girl. 
Ugh, uh, too easy. Yep. Gah. How many girls have you kissed, Audette? I don't know, four or five? Grace? Two? I thought for sure it would be more, sis. Nope, just Audette and one random girl at a party in high school. I can't believe you never kissed a girl, Evie. I hadn't ever kissed anybody before Aura. Aw, uh, I didn't know that. You two are so sweet. Sweet? It's tragic is what it is. Here, well, what are you? Ah! <laughs> All right, I'm taking a shot. Okay, I'm just gonna drink until I pass out, okay? <laughs> Audette! Huh? <laughs> Mwah! What the hell was that? Now you can say you've kissed a girl. I told you not to get too crazy. We've barely even started and... Would you relax? It was just a kiss. Hmm. Whose turn is it? Yours, I think. All right. Never have I ever snuck out of my parents' house. I find that hard to believe. Why do you say that? Her dad lets her do whatever she wants, remember? All right. <coughs> Phew. Okay, this stuff is really kicking my ass. Yeah, totally. Haha. <laughs> Maybe we should slow down a bit. No, we're not slowing down. It's your turn. Huh, fine. All right, I think that's enough. <laughs> Wait, what? Uh, that's enough games for the night. Well, I'm going to keep drinking. Huh? <clears throat> if that's all right with you three, knock yourself out. So, are you two dating now or what? Uh, I don't think we're ready to label it yet. But you like him, right? Mm-hmm. I know he likes you. Yes. And you've seen the scar. Huh? Audit. What? He has, hasn't he? I have. Can we be done with all the secrecy then, please? Hmm. Evie has nothing to be ashamed of. She should be proud. I don't know about proud. Scars are wicked sexy, girl. Uh, I agree. And I kind of, that's kind of what I said in the last, in that episode anyway. Not the last episode. I'm realizing I'm on two, hour two of recording this. I'm serious. Don't you think it's sexy, Aura? I do. You, you do? Aw. But, but, what about the rest of me? What are you talking about? You, you know, my tiny tits and my flat butt. Oh, for fuck's sake. That's what has you so shy all the time? Hmm. You've got to wake up, girl. Tell her, Aura. I like your body. See? I bet you've got delicious. <laughs> I bet you've got delicious little perky buds under there. And guys love that shit, trust me. R really? Hell yeah. I mean, look at your sister. Her tits aren't anything to write home about. Jeez, thanks. What? That's not... You know, I think yours are beautiful, but they aren't... God damn it, you know what I mean. <laughs> you mean she isn't stacked like you? Yes, exactly. She's not stacked like me, and she still has plenty of attention, right? Yeah. Men like all shapes and sizes. And you're cute as hell. <laughs> Ugh. You alright? Yeah, I just feel a little dizzy all of a sudden. Can I get you some? Oh shit. Eve? Blah. Is she puking? Y yeah, I think so. Shit. I told you this was going too far. Come on, sis. Let's get you downstairs and drinking some water. Hmm. Fuck. Talk about bad timing. Is Eve going to be all right? Oh, she'll be fine. Just a bit too much too quickly. Quite the night, huh? Yeah, pretty crazy. Audette, I need your help. Looks like our fun's getting cut short. You should head on home. We'll take good care of Evie. To be continued, stud. <laughs> Holy crap. That girl is big trouble. What a night, though. I think Eve and I might really be building towards something really special here. I'll have to be sure and check on her tomorrow. All right, so she's she's not at school, so I guess... Hey, Audette. Shh, not so loud, Aura. Hmm? Uh, turn off that bright light. Uh, you mean the sun? Yes, turn off the sun, please. <laughs> I don't think I could do that. What are you doing here so early? I wanted to check up on Eve and make sure she's okay. Well, aren't you sweet? She's probably doing a lot better than I am right now. Y yeah, you look really, um, hungover. Yeah. <laughs> I might have gone a little overboard with the fireball last night. Do you know how to make a Bloody Mary? N no God, I'd kill for a Bloody Mary right now. Are they upstairs? Hmm. Grace wasn't in the shop. No. Oh crap, if she overslept, she's going to be pissed. Why do you say that? Because drinking last night was my idea and she's already way behind on her rent this month. She is? Hmm, I probably shouldn't have told you that. Ugh, my head is pounding. I think you should be the one who wakes them up. Huh? W why me? Because if I go up there, Grace is gonna murder me. 
Uh, I don't know. You don't want to see me get murdered, do you, handsome? Uh, no. You'll be fine up there. They're both head over heels for you. Yeah, okay. Just be real gentle about it, okay? They're definitely going to be hung over, too. I will. Uh, hello? Hmm, nobody's here. They must be in the bedroom. Hmm? Uh, hello? Hmm? Okay, G Grace? Huh? What the? Oh, uh, Aura. I'm so sorry, I didn't mean- well, What are you doing here? I came to check on Eve and Audette told me to come up here and wake you guys up. Hmm? Oh, what's going on? N nothing I wasn't- Aura was worried about you and he stopped by to say hello. Really? Y yes Aw, that's so sweet. How are you feeling? Really, really, really hungover. <laughs> I think I just need a shower and I'll be right as rain. Well, you'll have to get in line. I'm going first. What? No way. Yes way. I've got a business to run. At least for the next few weeks anyway. Just don't use all the hot water. What did she mean by that? Oh, we haven't been getting many customers lately and she's worried about money. Really? Yes. She told me last night that she's thinking of picking up a second job. But, but, but she works so much already. I know, I told her it's ridiculous. If anything, I should be getting a job and giving her money, but she refuses to let me help out. Huh, there has to be something that we can do. Not that I can think of. Hmm. She just needs more customers, right? Yeah, I suppose. What if we advertised a bit? Hmm? Yeah, we can make some flyers for sugar tats and hang them up around town. Oh my god, why didn't I think of that? So, it's a good idea? It's brilliant, Aura. Come on, let's go in the living room and work on it while she's showering. All right. All right, I think we're really on to something here. Don't you? I like the I like the uh the charcoal <laughs> look on it. Uh you, yeah, it looks really good. Will your sister be okay with giving people 20% off though? Uh 80% is better than 0, which is pretty close to how many customers she's had recently. I hope you're right. Trust me. Oh my god, I feel so much better. It's all yours, butthead. <laughs> It's about time. What, were you in there playing with yourself or something? N no I'm just moving slow because I was up all night taking care of somebody who can't hold their liquor. <laughs> Touche. All right, let me hop in the shower and then we'll make copies and start hanging them. Sure thing. What are you working on? N nothing, just something for school. Oh? Yeah, I'll tell you about it later. All right. She's not in trouble or anything, is she? Nope. Thank God. I don't think I could handle anything else. <laughs> hey, about earlier. Hmm? You know, the thing I was doing when you walked into Eve's bedroom? Uh, oh, don't worry about it. No, no, I feel like I should explain. It wasn't anything weird or nothing. I just, it's been a while since the last time I, hmm. I mean, I haven't dated anybody in a long time and I'm just a little, um, seriously, it's cool. I'm not judging, believe me. Eve was out like a light and I just sort of lost my head, you know? Yeah, yeah, I get it. Just, um, don't tell her about it, please. I won't. Oh, God, don't tell Audette either. If she finds out, I'll never hear the end of it. I promise. Okay, phew. Thanks, Sora. No problem. You want to help me set up shop while you wait on my sister? Sure. Awesome. Just follow me downstairs. Uh, right behind you. Or you get yourself into some pretty... Uh, well, good morning, sunshine. You already set everything up? Yeah, call it an attempt to get back into your good graces after last night. Hmm. I can't believe you brought <laughs> that fireball whiskey out. Oh, come on. We were having so much fun. Yeah, until Eve got sick. Then I had to babysit her for half the night and hold her hair while she puked her guts out. Yeah, but you always take things too far on it. I'm sorry, okay? I was just trying to get you out of this funk you've been in lately. I'm not in a funk on it. I don't need release. I need someone helping me. You need to get laid. God damn it. Don't start. Huh? Look, I appreciate you helping me this morning. Thank you for that. Hmm. Now, can we please just talk about something else? Yeah, fine. You have a client scheduled in about one hour. After that, the day is empty. Christ, I hope we get some walk-ins. Yeah, this place has been dead recently. There you are. I was worried you'd left. Nope, I was just helping your sister open the shop. Thanks for the cold shower, by the way. Call it payback for cleaning up your vomit last night. Ha <laughs> ha. Ugh, whatever. Next time, just shower together. What? Then everyone gets hot water. Ew, gross. How is that gross? Um, because she's my sister? So? You're just washing in there, right? It's not like I'm telling you to have sex with each other. <laughs> or is like, but I wouldn't mind. All right. Just drop it on it. Sheesh, you two are so repressed. I am not repressed. 
Please. Whatever. Or and I are heading to the mall to make some copies of something. Oh, new drawing? Let me see. N no, it's just a drawing. So what is it then? It's a surprise. You'll find out soon. Come on, Aura. Uh, I guess I'll see you later. <laughs> later, big fella. See ya, Aura. I wish you'd quit calling him that. Psh, you want to see it just as much as I do. Don't try and deny it. Shut up. <laughs> I mean, Audette, Grace, if you want to see it, all you got to do is ask. Before we roll the end card, there's a few patrons I'd like to give a special shout out to. Huge thank you to Sifios, Cameron Baker, Carlos Reyes, Deadman2112, Joshua Hardy, Payne, Sir Knight Benz, Rashon242, Cairo Linian, Dominic Baker, a calm user, and of course, all my other beautiful, beautiful patrons. Thank you so much for supporting me on Patreon and allowing me to produce this content for you guys. <laughs> you do not know how much I appreciate it. But anyway, guys, let's roll the end card. So guys, Carrie here. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to see more, check out our previous video here. Or if you'd like to support the channel, check out our Patreon here. There's also a video that was picked up by YouTube just for you. And lastly, you can click here to subscribe. We'll see you in the next video. Peace off.